Okay, uh, I just wanted, I thought of, you know, doing a quick video to answer the first question for lab uh, six, week six lab. Uh, I'm doing, yeah, module six lab, actually, module six lab. This is about the Titanic. Uh, if you look at the question number one, how many married women over 50, age 50 were on board? Now, how do you find out uh, if they are, there are married women? Uh, you can see that, you know, the MRS is, you know, a sign. Uh, what I want to show you here is, you know, if you go to the data source, once you have the Titanic data set uh, brought in or uploaded, and then taking this Titanic worksheet and dropping over here, you will see that, you know, there's no other way to find out uh, other than using their first name, because the first name has, whether it is MR, that correlates with Mr. And MRS correlates with uh, Mrs. So um, how do you know if this person, this individual is married? You have you go by this uh, uh, letters, MRS. So uh, we are going to do the sorting based on gender and the first name and the age. These are the three uh, that we're gonna use here. So let's see how we're gonna do that. Uh, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the sheet one, and then I'm going to bring the uh, age into column, uh, and it comes as the sum. And now I am going to bring the gender into, where's gender, yeah, into the rows. Uh, and uh, also, I said, you know, the other variable that we need to use in order to drill down to understand uh, any female married uh, over 50 is the uh, first name. So we have the first name, and I'm going to put it under, oops, sorry, uh, first name in the rows column. Now we have everyone under their first name, but we don't know their age. Now, what do I do is I'm going to bring the age uh, into the size so that uh, you can see the age. Oops. Uh, and drop it in the size marks. And now, a some sort of a sorting is created over here. All right. Uh, however, we need to give the labels by pressing this T over here. Now we know what their age is about. Even though we have this age, uh, we need to, uh, based on the uh, instructions, we are supposed to we are supposed to uh, find only those who are above age 50. So what I'm going to do is I am going to uh, uh, take the age, and and then I have taken the age to uh, filter. Uh, now I am going to use the sorting function. Uh, you are going. To, we are going to highlight H, and then we are going to uh, hit the descending, uh, sort by descending. Uh, so I use that one. Then I can see now those who are above uh, fifty. So when I say above fifty. 50 is not counted. So anywhere from, uh, I mean, above 50. So you, we have to start counting 51 and above uh, until the age 88. That's the maximum age limit that we can see in this data set. So what do we do now? Now that we have this one, we need to get rid of all these and focus only on uh, those who are age above 50. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here, hover around here, and hit highlight it. And then I press Control, highlight the next, highlight the next, highlight the next. And I highlight all that uh, corresponds to age above 50. I highlight them. Let's see if I got everyone here. Uh, up to John. Okay, highlight, 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 
highlight and highlight yeah uh, the one below this uh, is is uh, 50 so we are not going to take we are going to only take this one and now what I do is here uh, and I'm gonna highlight that one and as you highlight you will see keep only see this one uh, keep only I'm gonna hit that keep only by doing so you will see how many there are uh, who are above uh, above uh, 50 years old uh, 50 years 50 years and old right so you can take account now one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen whatever the number that's going to be your answer right uh yeah that's what uh we are going to do uh when we answer the question number one in uh in the lab uh module six lab question number one okay uh hope that that is uh helpful uh, uh i think the rest is you know really uh um, pretty simple straightforward uh i'll catch you later with another new uh, quick video